What is up guys, Looters TCG here, and we have Magic the Gathering Commander. These came out not too long ago. I believe there's five of them. Five different ones out of doesn't show. But this is the nature of the beast. Pretty cool color combination there, red, green, and white. If you guys aren't too familiar with Commander, you use one uh, one commander. He's there the whole time on the battlefield. This one is uh, Marath Will of the Wild. Little, uh, looks like a voice resurgence friend there. So, Jerry, what does read what he says here? He enters the battlefield with a number of 1 1 counters on it equal to the amount of mana you spent to cast it. You can remove 1 1 counters on it, choose a target creature, deals damage to that creature or player, or put an elemental creature token on the battlefield with it. He's also contained 15 new magic cards never before seen. And let's see what's inside it. Three oversized foil commander cards, 100 card deck, and geared for multiplayer. We haven't been able to find the other ones yet. Only this one. Most of our game stores are all sold out. We didn't really get in on the pre-orders. And I'm trying to ruin the box too much here. It looks like I'm going to have to. Man. I really pack these in there. I don't want to take them out. This is going to be the that's going to be the one card. Not going to be all of them. Let's see when this that's a pretty cool little box there. Slides right out. And here's the other two. Here's a Gahi Honored One. Legendary Creature Beast. Whenever a creature attacks one one of your opponent's or a planeswalker and opponent controls, that creature gets plus two until end of turn. The red, green, white. And the other one behind that one. Ooh, that one there is like messed up. I don't know if you can see that in the video. Yeah, you can see that. Has uh, like a misprint. Maybe they don't take too, uh, they're not too careful in printing these big cards. I'm not sure. Is our first one we've actually owned. Mylia the Anima. Anima? Elf Shaman. Look at the top five cards of the library. I put a creature card with five pow power five or greater from among men of the battlefield. Put the rest in your bottom of your library. It's only three casting costs. Same as the first one I looked at. Here's a couple instructions. It's probably going to tell you how to play Commander and how to play the deck. And there's the uh, normal sized cards, not the oversized. In case you don't want to use the oversized cards as your Commander. All right, let's see what we can do here. Behind that is the Grazing Glade Heart. I'm going to try to kind of set this. This is the deck, 100 card deck. If you had more than one, this is what you'd be playing with. Coruscant War Chief. There's the uh, Mylia. Myel, maybe? Drum Hunter. Mold Shambler. It's a fungus beast. Kicker Cost. Terra Ravenger. Ravenous Baloth. Baloth? It's a rare. I'm not sure which of these cards are actually in the nor in the uh, like standard. It was came out in the standard set, or which cards are actually the new cards. Spellbreaker Behemoth can't be countered. Not bad. There's the other other commander dude. Rick Claw Gargantuan Spite Bellows. When it leaves the battlefield, it deals six damage to a target creature. It's not bad. Deadwood Tree Folk Crater Helion Helion. Hmm. A lot of these do damage other creatures. Pretty weird art on this one. Magus of the Arena. Six drop tagging card creatures. A Baloth Wood Crusher. Ram Rampaging Baloths. A lot of Baloths in here. It's a mythic. A Valley of Ranit. Renat. I guess it would be a lot of beasts seeing it's green centric. Green and red. Avenger of Zendikar. Must have been in Zendikar. There's a Croson Tusker. That art looks familiar. It looks like it's familiar on the other beasts, but... Cycles, it is a 6-5. There's an Archangel. It's pretty old-looking art on there. Flying Vigilance, 5-5. Five, five. Just like Sarah Angel, except a little bigger. Eternal Dragon. It's pretty cool. Naya Soul Beast. There's a Soul Ring. Everyone's favorite. Swift Foot Boots. Hexproof and Haze. That's not bad. Judic. Judic. <laughs> yeah. It's a hard word there, satchel. Let's call, let's call that card the satchel. A behemoth sledge artifact. Gotta use some equipment. Gotta get that old back into the game there. Seer sundial, tower of fortunes. Lots of rares. Dark steel mutation, curse of chaos. I haven't recognized any of these cards. War cadence. That one there looks familiar. Curse of the forsaken. Curse of predia predation. Fires of Yavimaya. An enchantment creatures control have haste. Why not? Where ancients tread, witch hunt, mystic barrier, war storm surge, spawning grounds. 
Pretty cool art. Burrow's Charm. Hey, that looks familiar. Sprouting Vines. Naya Charm. A Naya Charm, huh? Haven't seen that kind of charm. Slice and Twan. Slice and Twan. What is this? Street Spasm. It's from Ravnica. Restore. Put target land on the battlefield. Hall Breach. Cultivate. Fiery Justice. From the Ashes. Tempt with Discovery. Harmonize. Draw three cards for four mana. Wrath of God. Destroy all creatures that can't be regenerated. That's pretty cool. One dozen eyes. Slice and Dice. Reign of Thorns. Fireball. A lot of people talk about the Fireball. Savage Twister. Boros Garrison. Enter the battlefield tap. Enter the battlefield. Return the land and control to its owner's hand. Add a red and white to your mana pool. That's pretty cool. Boros Guildgate. Command Tower. Contested Cliffs. Drifting Meadow. Evolving Wilds. Forgotten Cave. You can cycle that card. It's pretty cool. There's a Gruel, Gruel Guildgate. Homeward Path. Each player gains control of all creatures he or she owns. Hmm. Jungle Shrine. A Colony Garden. Mosswort Bridge. Hideaway. This lady has the battlefield tap. When it does, look at the top four cards of your library. Exile one face down and put the rest on the bottom of your library. May you play the list. Play the exiled card if you play a forest. Anaya Panor Panorama. There we go. Panorama, as I say that. A new Belalia. Banalia. Scry one. Hey, that sounds familiar. Opal Palace. Rupture Spire. There's a lot of weird lands in this one. A lot of little one of Secluded Step. And it's a better field tap. You can cycle it. Slesnia Guildgate. Slesnia Shank Sanctuary. Slippery Karst. Cycles two. Twice. Smoldering Crater. Temple of the False God. Add two mana to your pool. Activate this ability only if you control five or more lands. Tranquil Thicket. Vidugazi the City Tree. Put one one green sapling token. Vivid Crag. Mountain. Mountain. I believe these are probably going to be the lands. Mountain, Forest, and the Plains. Not very many Plains. Just splashing the white it looks like. Alright guys, that's it for the Nature of the Beast Commander deck. Hopefully we'll have the rest of them for you. Thanks for watching. Till next time.